Yep, rock when and roll. Ready. <laughs> I'm ready to. Okay, rock and roll Olivia here at NAMM 2022. <laughs> 2022. I know, we two, made two, it. two. Can you believe it? We made it? Yeah, that we're still here. We're alive and everything. We're and alive. It's coming. We're masks on. Yeah, we're no, alive. we're here. It's kind of cool. So, this is uh, my good friend, Gio Loria. Hey. And how hey. you doing? Hey, I'm doing good. Awesome. Happy to be here. Yeah, you are, because you have this amazing booth right here with amazing amps that you make handmade, right? And also guitars. Uh, all handmade, yeah, guitars and amps. Yeah. This is the first year we're showing our uh, our guitars. Really? Okay, that's awesome. Yeah, I didn't think I've seen them before, but they're amazing. And I think with these amps and everything, they, this is like a hippie look to me. You could call it a hippie look, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, I mean, some people call it Southwestern. Some people call it hippie. Some of, some of the rugs are like... That's a, that's a Persian rug. It's probably 1930s Persian Kaleem. It's a Dia de las Muertes. Turkish rug, Southwestern, like Navajo rug, Southwestern rugs, blankets. Right. We like the blankets. That's awesome. So you're just creating, repurposing, or what are you doing? Repurposing, that's a good word. We upcycle, which means we find stuff to recycle and give it a different life, different home. We, um, we recycle, we repurpose. We're trying to save the planet, man. <laughs> That's right, we are. And so I even see you got guitar cases made of blankets. Is yeah. that Mexican or not? Uh, Mexican, Mexico. Southwestern, New Mexico, Arizona. It seems like I have a blanket that looks similar. That's why I bought it down in Mexico somewhere. So. But they're all vintage. So they're from the 40s, 50s, 60s. That's awesome. Yeah. So what do these amps go for? I mean, uh, I'm looking at, looking at this list of endorsee list. I mean... Joe Perry from Aerosmith. That's crazy. At, Man. yep, the Black Crows. Uh, who else? Matt Bradford. Who else you got out here? Guns N' Roses. Yeah. Wow, sits, that's sits amazing. He sits across the stage from Slash every night and yep. does this. That's so cool. I call it sitting. I don't think they sit, but. What does he got? Well, that's yours. A uh, guitar or amp? I'm making him a custom amp. A crazy horse, like okay. like that one. And yeah, and we co-designed and um, uh -huh. we co-designed this together. No way. And I built no this way. for him. Yeah. That's rad. So this was very inspired by Richard Fortas. He always he always does a reverse headstock. That's awesome. Yeah. So we worked a long time for probably almost a year talking about the details of this amp or what this guitar. This sorry. Look? You know. Modern day people call it relics, but they're actually faux or trying to emulate something that looks old. Yeah, 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 this yeah, is yeah. actually really old wood. Yes. So all of these woods, all of these, everything Ooh, is really so old. Smooth, yeah. yeah. Like feel that neck. How's that neck feel? Smooth. Pretty smooth, right? It's a hundred year old maple fence post. You're right. Oh my God, I can't believe you have this booth and you're doing so well. I mean, I can believe it, but what I mean is, I'm just impressed. Thank you. I had no idea. Thank you. Yeah, you're awesome. So like, let me grab this over here. Okay. Tell me more. Tell me so more. So this is just a really old ass piece of wood, right? Yeah. Like when I find this stuff, it's just construction salvage or came out of an old hayloft or a barn or a tobacco drying barn out of Nashville or whatever. So we'll take it and we'll re recycle it and turn it into that. It's rad. Pretty You're cool, rad. Huh? It's beautiful. Isn't that cool? Yeah. <laughs> super beautiful. And what's this one? That's a hawk. Okay. So look at it matches. Uh, let's go ahead. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. So we have a hawk amp. So we're doing some match sets, hawk guitar with a hawk amp. That's so rad. You're just so smart. Where are you out of these days? Um, my mind? No, I mean, I know you're out of your mind, but are you out of, like, the L.A. area, San Diego, um, uh, San Francisco? I mean, where are you? Yeah, we're right on, like, Hate, Hate Nashbury. Lying. <laughs> Liar. Okay, where are you at? Downtown L.A. All right, that's cool. <laughs> Do you have a website or anything? Or? We do. It's uh, blackvoltamplification.com. You're 
You were so awesome. I don't want to cut you off of this interview, but this is so fun. There's a lot of people that want to come into your booth. You got a little crowd happening here, so. Yeah, that is. It's pretty rad. So I'm going to let you go, Gio, but I want to know more and more, so. Okay? Yep. And I want you to be part of my uh, shows or things later. Thank you. Family. Yeah. Family. He's family. Yeah, he's family too. You got it. <laughs> Thank you. Okay.